Hello everyone, as you can see here, this is the Packard Bell Easy Note TE. Uh, this one built in comes in 500 HTD, okay, which is quite slow for right now for Windows 10 Pro. So, what are you going to do? We're going to show you how to swap the hard drive with the SSD, which is 2.5 inch SATA SSD. Uh, it's super simple. First, what are you going to do? We're going to flip it around. Put it upside down and right now this uh, as you can see this compartment this is for RAM and the hard drive okay so by using a screwdriver which is Phillips we're gonna take out and then we'll take out the whole drive and we will install this SSD so first is first we're gonna take out this battery and open up these two screws okay use any kinds of flat tools lift it up now that is the 3.5 inch western digital 500 GB hard drive what are you going to do we're going to take it out if you just pull it to the back it's going to come out like this now we need this caddy from the old drive this caddy is secure with four screw on the right one two on the left one two so total four so we'll take it out That is the front bit to the connection. Take it out. Just simple things. Okay. that's how simple it is now we're going to connect it back in here Walaikum assalam. So now everything is almost done. We're going to put it back. This is quite tricky to put it back. I push always from sideways like a bow. And as you can see now, it's flat. That's how you change your hard drive with the uh, SSD. Sometimes you can buy even pre-installed Windows 10, which is not actually a good idea. Okay, so that's how you change your SSD for Packard Bell Easy Note T. Quite old model from 2013, as you can see here okay make sure if you have comment leave it i would read it and if you do subscribe that would be great for me to reach to thousand subscribers thank you so much for watching bye for now